Hey guys, Ali here, your number one source for accountability and confidence. Today we are talking about three mega motivation tips for you to stay motivated as you are crushing through goals and continue to stay motivated even when obstacles and adversity strikes. So let's jump right in. Tip number one, gamify your goals. What does that mean? That means make it a game, right? Make it fun. Don't forget to celebrate when you hit small goals. Break up your goals into small bite-sized chunks to where they are achievable and celebrate hitting every milestone along the way. So think of a game, right? You don't start at the last level final boss when you start a game. When you're playing a game, you start at level one. Think of the infamous Pokemon. When you start out in Pokemon, you have a very low level Pokemon and you're fighting other low level Pokemon. You're fighting all the Rattatats and the Pidgeys, right? So celebrate every time on your goal achieving process that you be a little ratatat, that you be a little pidgey, because that's what's gonna take you to the big Zapdos and Charizard, right? So you need to make sure that you are leveling up with small goals and making it fun along the way. Because here's the thing, small, consistent actions lead to massive results. So make sure that you are gamifying your goals in any small way, whether it's for health, or business, if it's health, maybe you just need to start out with 10 minutes of cardio a day. When you hit that 10 minutes, celebrate, do a little dance, have a little fruit afterwards, whatever it is, a small celebration to celebrate that you hit your goal. If it's in the business realm, maybe you need to start prospecting. Maybe you've never prospected before. 10 minutes of prospecting in the morning, 10 minutes of prospecting in the afternoon and then you build up from there, right? So gamify your goals, build up to them and make sure that they are fun for you to hit. Tip number two, get accountability partners. At least one person, preferably two or three, who you respect, who are aligned with your goals, who are also looking to up level and develop themselves and make sure that they are holding you accountable. Because guess what? We will do more for others than we do for ourselves. If somebody is waiting for you, you made an appointment with somebody at the gym, at 6 a.m., how much more likely are you to show up at the gym at 6 a.m. if somebody is meeting you there, if your accountability partner is meeting you there, compared to if you just say, I'm going to the gym at 6 a.m. tomorrow, just to yourself. Tremendously more likely for you to show up at the gym. Actually, there's a study that was done that if you write your goals down and you look at them every day, you're 65% more likely to achieve them. But if you write them down, you look at them every day, and you have somebody holding you accountable for it, you are 95% more likely to achieve them. So make sure to use accountability partners because that's a no-brainer. And tip number three, pray and affirm. Whether or not you're a religious person doesn't matter. We can all agree that there are intangible energies in the world and in the universe that exist that we just can't see. Think about it. Have you ever met someone for the first time, you have no background or knowledge on them whatsoever and been like, I just get a weird vibe from that guy. Or you know what, I have a really good feeling about that guy, right? There's energies on a cellular level, on a neurotransmission level, on a level that we can't necessarily feel and touch their energies around us. And when we pray and affirm things in the universe, those spiritual, intangible energies work in our favor. So pray, you can say, please God, please Lord, please universe, please help me achieve this goal, please give me the courage to achieve this goal, you can pray and then you can affirm it as if it already happened. I like to give gratitude, affirming that something already happened. Like, thank you so much for helping me achieve this goal, blank. Thank you so much for helping me accomplish blank. Yes, I am so grateful that I am accomplishing blank, right? Affirming that it already happens in the universe is gonna start to line things up for you that will actually lead you step by step to accomplish these goals. So to recap, three mega motivation tips, guys. Tip number one, 
gamify your goals. Tip number two, get accountability partners. And tip number three, pray and affirm. If you got any value out of this video whatsoever, hit that like and subscribe button. Comment below, let me know which one was your favorite mega motivation tip. Stay motivated as you continue to ascend and don't forget to always keep ascending.